Alrighty, let's get into this Star Trek themed survival gameplay thing with random planet stuff. I don't know. I just felt like playing a normal game, sort of, of oh, Space Engineers with no restrictions whatsoever. I can build what I want, do what I want, and I thought I'd want to do it with a Star Trek theme because I like Star Trek, so that's what we're going to do. So here we are, I've made a custom ga uh, galaxy, no, I wish you could make galaxies. I made a custom star system, um, it's got like a bunch of planets, that planet has a bunch of moons, stuff and things for us to explore, it's got all the Star Trek resources and ores, so we're going to see how that goes. I haven't played with the Star Trek mod in a long, long time, so I think that it'd be a very interesting experience for me. Am I drifting? Is it, or is it my mouse? I think it's my mouse. I got too much uh, stuff on my desk. Got like notepads and things and all this crap from work, and I've even got like a bottle, empty bottle of water. <laughs> Everything's getting in my way. But anyway, here we go. Let's start off. We got this rock here, which I have no idea what it has on it because I don't have an ore detector, and I forgot that you don't start this game with an ore detector. So I think our first objective, our first goal, is to one get this mouse. Stop. There we go. Put that cord under there. The cord and the mouse. I have a wireless mouse, but I just always have it plugged in because the battery, <laughs> the battery going flat bugs me sometimes, and it does it at the most inconvenient times, like basically at any point. Oh, I just vented everything in the space. That's no, I don't want to access that. I want to close the door. Okay, let's do this. Now I didn't put. <laughs> okay, <laughs> apparently I just jumped off the edge. I didn't put all the automatic pickup mod on because I forgot. Um, that's fine. We won't be doing much hand mining anyway. We just gotta get enough of these rocks to hand drill. Yes, the hand. But the hand drill only works so far. Like, actually, well, gold is there. And hello, Sherman. Um. Okay. <laughs> I, I want a naughty detector because I don't want to have to stop at every rock, but yes. Uh, what was I doing? I was digging a hole. Because I want to build. I think the first thing I want to build is going to be um, a drill. Uh, is that wise? I don't know. It's just the way I'm planning on doing it. It will allow me to grab, it will allow me to grab a large amount of rock which I can then convert into... Yeah, it is better than nothing. I just don't mind the hand drill either. Look, the, the level 1 hand drill is... It, it's annoying. Inventory. But when you get to the... Um, when you get to the... Oh, there's lots of rocks fighting about. The elite tools and stuff like that. It's actually not that bad. Let's be honest. But yeah, um, I really should have put the automatic pickup. I don't know why I'm blowing around. These rocks don't matter. I don't look. It's just quicker for me to mine than it is for me to pick these up. But that's fine. Let's just do this. All right. So what do you think? Do you think I should start with a, a building a drill attachment to the ship, or uh, do I have to build the no the basic assembly can do the? Wait, no. I, I need a small tubes or large tubes. I don't know. <laughs> uh, let's see, what do I actually need for the drill? Um, I need large steel tubes, which I don't think I can make with the basic assembly, uh, with the ba uh, survival kit land. Let's have a look, production. No, we can't. Okay, well then, you just make that much. Get me all of this start up, and then we'll do it with an assembler. Just go for the basic assembler, because they force us to. Ore detector? Yeah, I think ore detector might be the best way to go. Um, let's have a look. Where would I stick this? I need to find somewhere here. Yeah, maybe we can stick this. It's going to break the lines. I don't really care about the lines on the ship. I've already got one. A world where I'm saving this ship. No, I want to build that. Okay. I think, we'll, I think we might put that in like... We'll put the basic assembler thingy here for now in that section there. There's so much stuff flying out. If I just dig a hole straight into the side of this asteroid, it'd probably be easier to contain these rocks. But hey, uh, just hold down F while we drill. In the meantime, we can tend to get most of it. Uh, yeah. Alright, let's do this. Actually, I think we have to make the basic assembly before we make an detector, because I don't think we can make the Wait, can we make detector? Bonus of the survival kit? That's uh, a question I didn't think to check. 
Um, move. Okay, let's call it that. Production. No, we can't. So yeah, we have to make the basic assembler first, unfortunately. Well, annoyingly. Okay, there's so much stuff over here. Eh. See, I can't help myself. I, I see the floating things. I'm like, I must pick it all up. And I'm trying to... There's so many floating things. Why did I do this? It's fine. <laughs> it's fine, Smokey. Calm down. It's fine. Uh, no. Okay. Let's grab this. Let's go and... Just keep digging this tunnel. Can If I keep digging this tunnel into the... In towards the asteroid, these little rocks can't float as way as easily. Though I feel like I'm digging in like to a side of a thin part. I could be wrong. I probably am wrong. Yes. Okay. Inventory full. full. Yeah, inventory's full. It was stuck in a tiny hole. Okay, there we go. Ow, that's a wall. Okay, have we got enough? ores to build the things that I need. We need 740 iron ingots. We're nearly there. We're nearly there. I hate the start. <laughs> the starts are so tedious. I, I like both love the start of games like this, survival games, and at the same time I'm just like, it so, takes so long to do things. Okay, we are digging the right way. This little hole isn't that big. I want all the asteroid rocks. Give it to me. I need them all. I think once we get the assembler up, we'll put, definitely get the ore detector up, and then I think we'll do. Inventory full. Um. We'll, so yeah, we'll do the assembler first because we have to. The, the just the basic one, not the full on one, and then we'll put a drill on the ship, and then then an ore detector. No, an ore detector. They no, no, no. We'll do the drill first. Then the ore detector, because the drill will just let us get a ridiculous amount of resources. Um, faster. Okay, well you know what, here, hold on, you don't need to really make me that. I can salvage the, the steel plates if need be. I really kind of just want that. Yeah. Okay, so we'll put... Let's design this thing while that's doing. Okay, so we'll put the that there so it's connected then we're gonna need an ore detector um, I don't have any mods that rely on the ore detector because there is that um, it's the, I can't remember what it's called but it uses the ore detector to detect things on asteroids right away I don't have that mod I don't remember if it's a mod or a script I'm pretty sure it's a mod I don't have that so we don't have to worry about where we place the ore detector, but I'm thinking we'll just dump that right here. Um, like so, why everything is like a brownie colour, I don't know. Okay. Apparently I was doing something before I started this world. That's fine. Um, yeah, we've got that. Put the ore detector there, we put that there. We're going to need, eventually, a refinery. So just give it, give it. So if we put the refinery here, just the basic refinery. All right, that'll go there. All right, so we got a basic assembler, a refinery. We got the ore detector and the drill. Now the drill, I would usually just stick out here. Um, is there an attachment point on the bottom of the survival kit? I think there is, isn't there? Uh, there is not. Okay, I was completely and utterly wrong about that. They do have it on each side. So, what we'll have to do is we'll have to make a thing. I'm not, I'm not going to do it right now because I don't want to evacuate the entire place into it. Uh, the oxygen. I need oxygen still. So, we might have to just make it like a little T junction here that comes and then a little thing that comes along here and hopefully a conveyor junction with what do you call the conveyors with armored conveyors yeah we've got the armored conveyors don't we uh we've got titanium ones we're not titanium we're not up to titanium uh just where's the damn vanilla ones <laughs> it's probably mods everything just it's right in front of me oh no there it is yeah so i think we might use like these blocks and as long as i make that solid surface be up the top there, 
it should remain airtight. Uh, is it airtight? Did I put build info on? Apparently, I didn't put build info on. Why don't I have build info on? Good work. Um, anyway, fix that later. Are we there? Are we done? How are we going? Uh, production. Okay, we are done. Sweet. Give me this. Are you going to be mad because I don't have enough steel plates? I'm going to be short, like 23. Okay, that's fine. That's all right. That's why we cannibalize our ship. So I don't have to deal with waiting for things. There we go. That's like, is that 23? I don't know how many that was. That was not 23. I'm five short. Of course I'm five short. Um, there you go. I just don't want to take it from the front of the ship because I don't want to vent the atmosphere. Energy low. I uh, know energy is low. All right. Uh, so we got that. Now let's do the or like can we build the ore detector? Basic assembler, radio detector components. We can. Sweet. So hmm, I wanted to do a drill first in my. I'm all over the shop. Um. Can we... I think we got all the bits for the drill. Yep. Looks like we do. Okay. We also need a couple of conveyor tubes, so... Let's just go one, two, three of those. And... Grab one of those. Then we can grab a bunch of stone, and then we can put the ore detector on, and then we can all love life and uh, be happy, merry, and all the other fun things. I don't need a drink, I'm thirsty. Okay. Alright. And of course this is when people decide to call me. They haven't been quiet all day. No one has given me a single second thought. And now, try to call me. So I'm just going to quickly put my phone on silent. And then we can be all happy dory and continue our lives without interruption. Because that is just the way cookie crumbles. Oh! Okay, just... Dog! <laughs> now my dog's annoying me. <laughs> okay. It's fine. I now got leads all over my hands. Um... Ow. Let's grab... How's the assembler going? Go in there, but you're gonna need a lot more... stuff. Okay. Oh, I guess we go back to mining. <laughs> this is why I want to get the drill up. Um, it's probably the, the refiner would also help as well, but I just yeah, I think the drill is the best option. God. Energy critical. Oh, my energy is critical. I know my energy is critical. When is my energy not critical? Thank you for telling me more than three seconds, more than half a second before I run out. Also, I do have that food mod on. I gotta remember that. Um, Inventory full. Yeah, that's bit of an issue. Uh, where's the sh vehicle? I don't know why I put the food mod on. I just sometimes like the food mod. We got an unknown signal out there. Okay, well why this does that? I'm gonna go grab this unknown signal. Hopefully we can get there within two minutes. Uh, I don't trust. There we go. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna lose, I'd lose the swarm pod if I didn't put a GPS marker down. I have done that before in the past, lose the lose my vehicle. I don't know if I've done the spawn pod, I'm pretty sure the spawn pod just stays respawn pod on the screen the whole time, but I don't know. We'll see. I just want uh, I want food, I want water, so I can not have to worry about food and water for a little bit longer. Just to help tie me over that next little bit. Please and please don't be one of those ones that like tries to run away from you. I hate those signals. This is further out than I thought this was. It's alright. Be there in a sec. No oh, that was a terrible life choice of my mistake. Oh no. <laughs> um. Alright. Uh, uh. This is stupid. I shouldn't be doing this. Low health. Uh, where's home? Yeah, we're not gonna make it. That was a. That was a dumb. I did a dumb. 
At least we launched my stuff back at the rock. <laughs> oh. Alright. Can I... Yeah, let's try it. Do that. Where's my stuff? I don't think I had anything on me. I did the stuff that we went all the way out there to get. Oh, now my food is all ruined. Wow, that is, uh... They nearly made it all the way home. <laughs> oh, where is it? Oh, that's my... Ah, I'm doing dumb. I'm going to this, <laughs> the GPS mark on. It's okay. I promise you I'm a professional. At something. Just probably not this. Alright, let's grab this stuff. We're going to immediately need to have the food and water. We don't have anywhere to sleep. Ah, oh, that was a... That really was a dumb on my part, wasn't it? That was, um... It's gonna... That's gonna leave... It's gonna leave a mark. It's gonna... Yeah. <laughs> oh, why did I do that to myself? It's fine. I'm not going to that Mayday. I've already killed myself doing something stupid. I knew... I was just ranting about how they don't give you enough warning about being short and things and... Where has Sparky got to? Ah, uh, don't worry. Sparky will join us eventually. She is just... She's just, um... Away on business right now. <laughs> oh. Sparky will always return up. Always there. Be the bane of my existence. Hey, look, there's a mining transport out there. I haven't decided how I'm going to go in this world yet. Though I do know that we have everything with the Star Trek mods, the weapons on this uh, are a little bit crazy. They, um... They, uh... Yeah. They, they, they shoot from, like, five kilometers out. Like, I can't even see things from five kilometers out sometimes. It's fine. It'll be fine. I'm sure it's fine. It'll be fine, right? 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 Probably not. <laughs> Alright, we're back here. I'm alive. Nothing bad happened. I don't know what you all are talking about. I do not appreciate these accusations of me dying from stupidity. That never, ever happens. Never. Um... In the meantime, is there a panel on the side of this? Why? Oh, that's right, there's no gravity either. Is there a panel on the side of this? I think there is. Yes, there is. So I can safely remove this. Alright. I'm gonna need to... Um... Hey, have a cosmic coffee. Uh, that... That did a little bit of sleep? Okay. That kind of makes sense, but we're still gonna have an issue with food. Have a clean cola. Still gonna have an issue with food. Um, we'll ignore the food issue. Because that's the way to do things. Um, stop painting everything into space. Oh, so my helmet's off. Um, what was I doing now? So I did that. I built... Oh, we probably don't have enough stuff to finish off here. We've got to do more mining. It's the bane of existence. This is why I want to get the... I think I've already had this conversation. We're having a bit of deja vu here. Pitch black and you can't see. Let me just grab all these rocks I've left behind. You are annoying me. Yeah, let me through. I really should have put the pickup mod on, but hey, you know what? It happens. It happens. Inventory is full. This is the most. How many rocks are up there? What's it like a secret stash? Um. I said go in there. Also, my hand is sore. There we go. My mouse, my keyboard is off to a weird angle. <laughs> Everything is just off kilter a little bit today. Uh, you're not stuff. You're just weird little bumps on the asteroid. Okay. All this stuff. All right, let's go. All right, so once we get this done, we can get into the real nitty gritty. So. I, I, I've got a bunch of... I've got a couple of Star Trek ships I built in Blueprints, but I kind of want to try build one fresh. And I'm thinking... Um, the first one... Excuse me, let me out. First one, I don't know what I should build. I'm thinking I should build... Should we build a... I think I might build like a little... Runabout-inspired ship. Um, 
Should we do the runabouts? The runabouts are pretty good. You can live on the runabouts. There's a little walkthrough. So I think we might do a runabout inspired ship for our first one. And then... Why does it sound like thunder? Not real life. Hmm. Interesting. I don't want to know what is out there that's making thunder sounds. Uh, <laughs> it's in, definitely in a video game. It's not real life, so... Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, we want to build a runabout, I think, first. And... Should we build a space... I don't know if we should build a space station. I think I want to keep mobile for now. Uh, I don't know... Am I actually going to be able to build a runabout? I should be able to build a runabout, but I don't really... Uh, it's going to have to be a small grid, because... A, a large grid... Uh, it might really be a runabout then, is it? Well, uh, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> full. Should I just go for a normal size ship? But then you can't move a normal size ship. You can just live off this thing and I have enough resources. Full. Maybe we should just build a small little outpost station. And then... Ugh, I hate not having a gravity. Alright. How you going? Can you do that last? That's really not a high priority for me, they're steel plates. I can just salvage them from other things if need be. Alright, I'm stuck on something. Move! Okay, so we're gonna have to vent the ship into space for a minute. I think. Maybe? No, we won't? Okay, well we will once we grind that bit off. Um, let's grab... There, don't have enough small steel tubes in inventory. Well, luckily for me, that ain't really the priority for me. Okay, so if you're up like that, theoretically that should be... Actually, yeah, hold on. Alright, vent everything into space. Or not, it didn't vent everything into space? Excuse me, are you... Oh, that's right, these windows do weird things. Uh, I forgot about that. They're like airtight all the way around and there's a vanilla window so I don't know why but you know what, we're not going to worry about it. We will just accept our small fortunes and move on. Okay. So all of that will be connected. We can now stick this drill on here which we don't have enough components to build. Not even close. I didn't think I would to be honest but you know, small tiny bit for me hoped that I would. What else are we going to need? Oh, we're only going to need large steel tubes? That's our only issue? I like that. Um, production. Go away. Make these. I need... How many of those do we need? We need four. Uh, Eleven, really. Um... Do you, does this thing have any? Here's hydrogen. You got twelve. Oh, sweet. I don't use the hydrogen engine. I just need to steal all the way. There we go. That's good enough. So that's probably disconnected the... No, the oxygen's connected there, but it would have disconnected the rest of the bits. It's fine. Um, it's fine. More important for me right now is to get um, this trill up and running. Alright, put this here, go here, block tools there. Doesn't really matter where I put it. And now... I can get way more iron or uh, stone than what I've gathered by hand this entire time that I've been playing. Alright. Alright, there we go. I really should have put a build info on, I forgot about it. It's fine. I'll put it on next time. Uh, so you got like, look, look at all of this stone we had already gathered. It does like significant, we just, I think that was the, we gathered just as much stone as we had mined. Previously, because you can grab what ten stone each time, and I think I've done at least five or six trips. So, yeah, there you go. All right. So, what do I need to put this back together? Because unfortunately, I just need the steel tubes. Sweet. Because unfortunately, we do actually. Oh, look at that. That worked out well. Except during the basic assembly, which is over on this side, which I can't now access. Except I can access it because I can go here. Yeah. There we go. I just want to. Yeah, apparently, we need this. It's like a key conveyor junction. There we go. Whew, progress! Now I need to build the refinery. Alright, so refine... nope. Refinery... Don't know what that thing was. You're like that, not enough steel plates and stuff for build things. Alright, so we need 95 steel plates, motors, computers. 
Okay, so I think what I want to focus on first is the motors and that. Did, it, did I need the construction components? No, I didn't need the construction components. Okay, so we'll put those at the end of the list like that. Oh, excellent, excellent. Why are you making that? We don't need that. I want you to focus on that. Rude. I don't care how you make my damn steel plates. I just want my steel plates. Um, can we salvage steel plates from other places to maybe speed this along a little bit for now? I think I, I didn't want to take all of that, but that's fine. It's not like it's important. You don't really have much on you. Alright, how many more do we need? We need another 76 plus the motors and computers. That's fine, we're getting there. Uh, give me those. Give me those. Alright, now all we need is 40. Do we have like two large blocks I can just pinch? Or I've already pinched all the large blocks. I think I've already pinched all the large blocks. What have you got in here? You got 100? Can I just borrow that many? Thank you. God. I'm just like Frankensteining. I'm one short. Boo. There we go. Thank you. Now you, take all the stone and make it much quicker. <sighs> we live to fight another day. <laughs> Alright, what we need to do now is the ore detector and I think a couple solar panels. So, let's... Wait, can you build an ore detector? I don't... Yes, you can, can't you? Okay. Let's make that sound. Why are you doing that? Are you? We can't be running out of power. We're running on battery power, which means we should have. That's rude. The door just knocked me back. Um, we should have what? We got about an hours with the battery, which is fine. That's all we really need. All right, why are we here? Let's just grab a bit more of this. Some more building materials without smashing our face against the wall. There we go. Should just build like in a circular pattern motion, but whatever. We're just gonna dig holes into everything. I'm sure it'd be fine. Um Oh, that was stupid. Um Okay. Oh, or detector. Steel plates, motors, computers, and detector components. That's fine. So we need just motors, computers, and detector components, because that'll make it work. Production, motors, computers, and detector components. In that order. Alright. And then... Survival kit, you're not making stuff anymore. Excellent, we don't need you to make any stuff. And the dog is now wanting to go outside, which is now ready to commence his cat mode, where he comes in and out, in and out, non-stop. So, let's let you go. Alright, you go. Back to in a couple of minutes, and also we need food. Um, okay, well, we need food. Uh, the problem with that is I need small grid stuff too. Uh, let's go control two. Oh, that's what I was playing with before. I wanted to see what the consoles look, the Star Trek consoles look like. They, they're okay. Um, anyway, moving on. We need landing gear, we need just a small battery. And what's that stupid food thing here? Um, is there a basic like ration kit making thing on the large grids for the eat, drink, sleep thing? I can't remember. I've never been able to find it if there is. Um, what are they? What was I doing? I need to finish that ore detector off too. I need motors and computers. Uh, that. You really have an issue with the motors, aren't you? No, you got the motors. Did I grab the motors? You need one motor. Okay. That's why there's one motor sitting in there. Ugh. Goddamn gravity. Alright. There we go. Put that in there. Totally worth the hassle. Also, now I need you to build one of those. One of those. And one of those. Um... But the main thing I need to build right now is this. Just go like that. Please don't float away. And then... Oh, let's get the hole too. I've done this annoyingly. 
Need one more display. Come on. Production, do the damage display. Thank you. Alright. Put that up. Oh, you need four motors as well. God, why do you need motors? Build this. Stop with the light. Steel plates last. Steel plates are able to be gathered from anywhere. Alright. Yes, do that. Sweet. Yeah, do my battery. So I can get this. Also, I don't have any ice, I don't think. Do we have ice? We've got like a small amount of ice. Give me like all of it. Okay. Um. Now, let's go control two. Give me a battery. Give me landing gear. Did I not ever grab me that? Right, don't touch it because I don't want it to float away. Bam. Then we put the battery just like here, and then put this like here. Okay. Okay. I don't want to access the control panel. I want to open the door. Because we are seconds away from dying. Actually, I don't know if enough will make it because I think the, the food thing takes a minute to grab. There we go. Perfect. No, don't knock me away. I need gravel. Alright. Where is the access point on this thing? That'll do. Um, you have that and that. And then produce me some food, please. I think we'll make it. I think we're fine. I think we're good. I think we've got this. Okay, give me this. I need some iron ingots. Is that enough? Should be enough for it. Put that on in here as well. And that way we can make some of that water and we are now going to survive and no death from water i prefer not dying to water and food but i definitely push it now all we're going to do is something about the sleep issue uh you eat that num 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 a very slow way of these rations but you know what gotta wait till i finish eating apparently these rations are slow, but you know what? They get us through. They tie us over. And that's what we need. I need a lot of rations, apparently. It only does 10% per ration pack. That's fine. That's fine. Um, I'm going to let all of that build, and then we can eat all of that in a minute. So we've got our ore detector finished. We've got our refineries, our basic assemblers. Alright, I think it's time that we move on from this asteroid. I've already put a GPS mark in here, didn't I? It's a bit far away. Let's put... Uh, let's get rid of that one. I'm just going to put this new one here and name it our very first Roid. Alright. We've got nickel and gold here too. We should grab some of that. I think the gold is like buried inside the asteroid, which is a little bit of a pain in the buttocks. And how close can we get? Oh, I'm smacking. I didn't smack into anything. I'm not a bad pilot. I don't know what you're all talking about. There's no evidence. Moving on. Alright. We're just going to have to dig a big ass hole. Like this. So it can fit the ship in. Just a little bit. I just want to grab a bit of gold before we leave. Alright. Yeah. should be enough. How much gold did we get? Uh, gold. 14,000. That will tie us over for now and we'll grab some nickel. I think we'll head over to another asteroid to see if we can find some things like iron. Um, there's a nickel. It's up top. Right. Uh, you be on the surface. Be on the surface. Thank you. That's why this ship does not have much maneuverability once you start, you know, making it heavy. <laughs> Keep that in mind too. It's fine. That's right, you can't refine the gold anyway, but you can do the nickel. Alright. 
Okay. Now, so just before we leave, I'm just going to quickly... I can't for first roid. I'm just going to put gold slash nick. Just so I know that there's gold and nickel in here. Alright, so which asteroid do you think we should go to? Um, I'm thinking that one because it looks like it's the closest. So we're going to go there. See what she has. Actually, we'll stop by this unknown signal first and then we'll go there. The reason I keep stopping by these unknown signals is because I need things like um, algae paste or whatever it's called so I can make tofu. And tofu is better than no food. <laughs> it's better than rations at the very least. Um, and I can make it in the kitchen, I think. Mean. And we can grow more tofu from. I could grow more aloe from tofu. You love watching the series? Thanks, Thomas. I love bacon them. And John. Yeah. Yeah, it does look like a good one, doesn't it? Ah, I like, I like things. Hey Blackstar, how you going mate? Not much is going on. Alright, let's go. And I totally haven't died yet. Just started, I haven't died. It's a perfect run so far. There's no evidence to the contrary. And uh, anyone who says otherwise is, is a liar. Did I? Yeah I did. <laughs> For a second I thought I didn't grab the um, the Vietnam. I want to go to Vietnam one day. Ugh! <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Don't text and drive. Do you think I can catch it? Oh no. I'm gonna try to catch it. I'm gonna try. Where are you going? It's fine. <laughs> Just gotta control Z. It seems to have stabilized itself. Um, uh, Rainbow Grinder. I have a hundred of those. I think you'd sell them on the Steam Marketplace apparently. For like a cent. <laughs> That'd be interesting. Turbo's back. He wants to come back inside now. I told you he'd be back. He's going to be like a cat all day. He's going to be in and out, in and out. He likes to do this. I'll open the door for you in a sec, bud. I just need to... I will be there in a second, Turbo. He's bashing the door now. He's not happy. He doesn't like it when I close the door, but I have to close the door. Haven't died. Let's start a counter. No, that's not necessary. There's going to be no need for a counter. It's just going to be zero the whole time. I swear. I promise. I'm good at this stuff. I am amazing. Something that you can always trust is that I am amazing. Now, where did that really nice asteroid go? Where did you go? How did I lose a giant ass asteroid? Was it that one? No, that's where we came from. Was it... I've lost a giant asteroid. <laughs> that's the problem when you go chasing things. Okay, so we're coming from there. I think we're going to that one, won't we? Is it that one there we're going to? Um, it is now. I think it was. I don't remember. Oh. Uh, yeah, it was this one. It was. I remember the red dot. There's a red dot on top on the tip of that thing. Okay, so we still need food and we still need sleep. So we should probably, I should build one of those little bunk bed things that they have in this game now. That could give us our sleep. Uh, and for the food, we got a bunch of rations being made, so I'm not too worried about that. What do we got here? We got platinum. Platinum's always good. And iron. Excellent. Two good resources right off the bat. It was a good choice. Yep, I think Jonathan was right. This is a good one. Okay, let's just go, okay, we got GPS. I, I know I can do this from the chat, I just keep forgetting to be honest. I only just remembered as soon as I opened it. Iron, and we got plant, that's how I remember things. Okay, let's grab some iron. There's that rock there. Uh, I should, oh, yeah, we got platinum. Okay, so I think we might try to start building some extra thrusters for this pod while we're here. Oh, don't have to hit it so hard, Smokey. I mean, it'll be fine with we'll just... Yes, just insert my... Yes. Alright. Let's have a look. I just thought, maybe I should put a piston on this drill. That doesn't seem like a terrible idea, does it? Putting a piston on the drill head? I'm sure that won't... No, there's a rock somewhere above me. I'm sure that won't end terribly. Playing is much more cooperative these days. It's, 
as he gets up there in the years, he's becoming less and less um, evil. Oh, why is the platinum never on the surface? I want you to be on the surface. Why are you inside the asteroid? Subgrids are always a great idea. See, I knew. I knew there was another one out here like me who agreed with these types of ideas. <gasps> uh, break! <sighs> yeah, we need to get more thrusters. <laughs> I also need to get a bit more careful with our fly, but listen. If you have more thrusters, you don't need to be more careful. Alright. That seems like a fair thing. I saw platinum all over on this side. It, all the platinum is buried on this asteroid. This asteroid's a tease. It's not gonna make my life easy. Stop moving! <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's go here. Right. We're just gonna have to... We're just gonna have to drill our way in. I'm sure I'm not gonna regret making this decision. I don't know where Turbo's gone, he's must be sitting right behind my chair. Right. Hey, is he back there? Oh, that's right, I didn't actually let him in. That was a mistake. Sorry, Turbo. Here you go. He's your good boy. Hey, you good boy. You look like you're up to some mischief. Alright, I'm sure the dog being up to mischief won't be an issue. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, Blackstar. You you understand. You, you you get it. Hello, Turbo. Yes, I know. You want <laughs> you want more attention. It's fine. It's fine. I'm trying to I'm trying to dig a giant hole. This is not working out. This is not working out. I like the way I want. So you know what that means. Just because for the lols of it. I'm gonna have to. I'm just gonna have to do the pistons. The piston on the drill head. It's just gonna have to be a thing. Alright. Watch me like mine this thing right into an like, open hole that I could have just easily gotten to it from. Every time, without fail. Uh. Okay, let's go. Let's do this. It'll be fine. It's always fine. See? Jonathan gets it. He knows. He understands. Everything's always fine. There's never any problems. Whatsoever. At all. Never. Look, like, I can't even refine this yet. I don't have a refinery for it, but... I want it. I needs it in my life. It needs to be in my hole. Put it in my cargo area. My rear cargo needs it. I need to put this junk in my trunk. I don't know. I'm gonna stop now. Um, what's out there that's red? Oh, the pirate mate, eh? We don't care about the pirate mate, eh? Why would anyone ever care about a pirate mate, eh? But, I mean, if it's a pirate ship, it might have loot. No, no, no. no. It's a trap. We all know it's a trap. But it might not be a trap. It's a trap, Smokey. 26k, that'll do. Alright, can I get out of here? Hey, I actually didn't do a bad job mining out that hole. Alright. <gasps> That's alright. I didn't nearly hit a rock again. It's fine. It was just... It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's fine. You nearly hit a rock. I'm thinking we go... That asteroid I'm facing at right in front of me there. I think that might be a good asteroid. Also, I should probably... Get some food. While we're doing this. I love it. when they set this thing up so that you could just match the speed. That was an amazing addiction. Ad addition? Ad not an addiction. It's only a trap if you don't know it's a trap. Yes, and if you know it, that, and if you know it's a trap, then it becomes your trap, right? What if you hear me? Ah, oh, adding more drills. Doesn't that just seem a bit excessive, Blackstar? Like, come on, I, you don't want to be that guy in the universe with like drills. Like enough drills to do the job efficiently. You don't want to be that guy, right? That guy never... <laughs> that guy never has any... Yeah, it's just... Yeah, God, that's crazy talk. I think we should get some... How do you match speed? Control-Z. If you're looking at um, a ship, 
you gotta be close to it. Uh, it, it's not exactly the most, but it, it's a bit, it, it doesn't, it's not, it doesn't work all the time. It will eventually work, it's just a bit finicky, but yeah, if, if you look at a ship and you press Control Z when you're close to it, uh, your character will match speed with it, it's automatically. You can also do it while in a ship, you can match a, your ship to another ship if you're sitting in a control seat. Um, it's good for pirating, basically. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's control Z, it's like an awkward button press too. But it works, it works well, when it works. When it works, well, when it works, it works well, and it works great. And then, I think you can, I don't know how far it lasts. See, like it says auto dampeners, auto. I might just hit it when it's off. Um, like, it just, it, it just sticks speed. Like, the, we're moving 46 meters a second and I'm keeping up with it. Like, here, let me just disable it for a sec. See, it's flying away. Oh crap, that was probably not a wise idea. Then you go up to it, press Control Z. There. Now I'm just... Match speed with it. Now I need to get back in this cockpit because we're flying, we're hurtling towards an asteroid and should not be floating about in space when that's happening. Though I did do the smart thing and set me on a course just slightly off kilter to it, but you can't trust everything you see in this world. Sometimes, sometimes things like to hit you in the face. Also, this is taking longer. I need to build the bed. Um. Stop pushing me back, it's very rude. I need gravity generator. Um also need ice. Uh what's the bed? Just give me the half bed. Alright, can you do I have enough stuff? No, you can build it for me though. Alright, let's get back let's get back to the cockpit. Alright. Did I put the oil mod that lets me make this larger? I did. That's obsolete now, there is plugins, I know, plugins. I don't know, I just have an aversion to plugins. I've had a bad experience with plugins before and I don't know. Everyone has their own weird tediums and for me plugins are one of those things I just I just don't trust them. I don't know why I trust a mod but I don't trust a plugin. But, uh, previous experience. <laughs> uh okay. Are we there yet? It's a pretty big asteroid this one. It looks like a Kinda of looks like a dragon's face. Like he got the mouth, his mouth is open, he's got an ear up the top left and an ear up the top right that's cut off and a nose on his forehead there. Just need some eyes somewhere. It's like kinda of like a little divot above there. Is that not? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what. This is forever now known as Charizard Rock because it kinda of actually reminds me of Charizard from Pokemon. Am I delusional? Does it not kind of look like a mouth and a dragon? No? Yes? I mean, come on, it clearly is. I'm, I'm naming it Dragon Rock, so... Like, it's gonna happen now. 